YouTube, I was not expecting to uh, have a trailer today. So we have the hero trailer for Juno. Uh, very interested, because we had the gameplay trailer earlier. So seeing a normal trailer now will be interesting. Um, very excited to get some more uh, backstory on Juno. And it's called Control, so let's get into this. Oh, damn. Oh, so is this like when... Uh, Oh, so this is right after... Oh, this is right after the comic, I think. Flight, we're wondering why you haven't fired primary boosters yet. All systems appear optimal. I just need a minute. It is so hard to say goodbye. Mm -hmm. To the only home I've ever known. I understand. But the colony isn't safe anymore. And our window of opportunity is closing. Let's get you on your way to your new home. Next stop, Earth. Oh, interesting. It looks like a different style. Initiating boosters in three, two, one. That a girl. Uh, That's control? not good. Our sensors indicate an external issue. External? Follow protocols and you'll be fine. But you have to hurry. External. Is it that thing there? Careful. I'm going to find a way to save you. All of you. Okay. Hold it. This is actually no, no. terrifying. No, no. I believe in you. You've trained for this kind of thing your whole life. You have all the tools you need. Do this. Okay. All right. I have all the tools I need. <sighs> <laughs> okay, nice, uh, nice cool back to the highlight intro there. Control, problem solved. Oh, hear that? We're all so proud of you. I want you to live a long, happy life on Earth, sweetheart. Always remember. Oh, there's a 3% chance it's not gonna work, though. You see that? Because the the curve has gone so far now. You too, Mom. <sighs> okay, Earth. Here I come. Fifty-five million kilometers later. No problem. Hold your approach and identify yourself. Uh, it is too late to hold. I'm coming in. Is this? This is Overwatch. I am tracking your. Oh, Athena! And we'll have someone meet you. For my records, where did you come from? I am from Mars, and my name is Juno. Okay, interesting. So that was kind of cool, terrifying. <laughs> Okay, now this. This is great. This is great. Um, this is terrifying to an extent. Could you imagine just suddenly, like, one, you're supposed to leave your planet. 
so the 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 the, the whole aspect of that two you then kick something with your boot or you kick some rock with your boot and by doing that it breaks your boot which then makes it so you can't properly like maneuver about and now you're just floating out into the deadness of space dude that's terrifying um different art style than normal which is kind of interesting the last couple of these i feel like they've changed they've been changing the art style a little bit it feels like one after another after another like the malga one was different than i don't even remember if we had a venture one to be honest with you now that i'm thinking about it to now this one i do i I'm, now that I'm saying that, did we have a venture one? I need to look at this real quick. Now that this is on my mind, and it's going to be stuck on my mind for a little while. So there's that. There's the venture story. That's not what I'm looking for. We had the venture's adventures, which is the exact same thing here, I think. No, this is... Maybe the same thing? Either way, this art style versus the Malga art style versus this art style are three completely different art styles so it's interesting that they've they're changing their kind of their approach to it one by one by one i don't know if they're trying to find a new style or if they're just constantly keeping it fresh and seeing what they like more um i do like the fact though that they add a little bit more backstory here this is between at the end of the comic she leaves she's uh, they, she's being told that she's going to leave the planet and then at the very beginning of her trailer for the gameplay trailer we see her flying into earth so this fills the gap in between those two areas not really needed but it's just the fact of just adding a little bit more of a connection to juno and you know like the whole well the, her whole goal is to get her family and get the family and beasts and have them safe on mars and, or get them back to earth or be reunited with them basically to make sure they're okay right is the big thing here along with showing you know like kind of like you know the okay i can do this i can do this i can do this that just adding a little bit of emotional attachment to the character which i dig um it is like I said. It's interesting that they keep changing the art style. I would like more of these. I still, I still don't know why we don't have a, a like a show or uh, just even like a little web series, like a little five to ten minute web series where it's all art style stuff and they just go through it. I don't know why we don't. I think this would this would be insane if we did. It would add so much to the game. It would add so much to the game, the lore, the community, everything. Um, but anyways, what do you guys think of the trailer for Juno? Do you like Juno? Do you not like Juno? I haven't gotten to play Season 12 yet. I'm going to be playing Season 12 here in probably the next, like, 20 minutes to an hour. So, I'm excited to get on and play Season 12, start my re-rank, uh, and figure out what everything is, uh, what all the new, the new things actually feel like. So, um, yeah. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments down below, right? Juno! She's dope. She's dope. As always, Venom Way, I'm one after even I still triple stay safe. We we'll talk to y'all later. <gasps> okay, bye. Um, don't, just so you know, because I know you're a little upset right now, I'm not going to be getting a Winton plushie. We have you. We don't need Win we don't need a Winton plushie. As cool as that would be to have you and Winton, we're just staying with you because you're the OG. He's the OG. He's been here forever. So yeah, don't worry, Amy. <laughs>